Hello there, Internet. My name is Y Dragons, and today is moving day, finally. And the reason why we're moving is, is if you look over to the left, you'll see there's 272 entities out of 392, and that keeps jumping. Uh, when that jumps up to 300 out of 400, basically everything comes to a halt. So, with that being said, we need to leave this area. But I'm going to pretty much leave a couple of things behind. Uh, I am going to leave some th these, the trees that are lined up here. Give me that. I am going to leave the trees that are lined up here. I am going to uh, leave that. I'm going to take this with me, and I'm going to take this with me. But I am going to leave the food. Um, there is something else I'm going to take. It's a pumpkin. 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 It's here. Melon. Oh, it's almost ready to. Oh, well. Got to take it pumpkin okay so that's good enough where is the sun sun's at high noon but yes uh because of the huge amount of entities that's going on i think it's slowing us down to almost to a grind so i've went ahead and made a new place which i think would be pretty cool and uh just again i'm gonna probably give this seat out and i'll probably give the location out here shortly on where i'm gonna be at so that way you may be able to find this dungeon and you may be able to find some other cool stuff to help me out with. Again, like I said before in the very beginning, I did pre-survey the area because I wanted to get started in an area that I could actually work with. A lot of these Let's Plates I've seen has had to move like I have had uh, because of the, uh, the amount of mobs that are spawning in the dungeons. And uh, I went and created another world and just checked out this one small dungeon that I found. And it literally had Goku amounts of, sp of spawners and Goku amounts of, of just treasure. That was just awesome. So I can only imagine what ours is going to hold for us. Um, so this barley. Is this barley? Let's see. Seeds! Ooh, we got wheat. We got wheat. Oh, this is going to help out a heck of a lot. Yeah, I'm going to leave that, though. Uh, so this is going to be our new home. Uh, I actually got this build from Minecraft Builder 95 and uh, he actually has a 15x15 15 15 design. I changed it up a little. I kept with the bottom 15x15, 15 15, but extended it out to where I had some towers and whatnot. And of course, I don't have a lot of material. Uh, so I'm basically using what I had available to me, which was wood, dirt, and cobblestone. Over time, we'll change it. We'll make it look a little bit prettier. A little bit perker. There's also a castle over there, or an observatory, or whatever the hell you all want to call it. And I did put um, back on uh, journey map, because it wasn't journey map so much as if I had gone in here and I turn on, like... Uh, monsters I will literally f cause a lot of slowdown so I don't turn don't turn that on and get the hell away from entities that are more than like like what you see here I mean, I mean we're literally sitting at 198 and if I point in that direction there's literally 230 or 255 Jesus webs um, I don't want that because I don't want that I don't want to be nowhere near that so uh, there is a dungeon down there did uh, kill some stuff along the way so we do have an iron sword and it has mending one on it the problem is this weapon we can't use we have to make a, a smeltery I even have a little back porch here isn't that cool um, a smeltery so that we can uh, make better weapons and better tools but in order to do that we're going to need to make a actual smeltery from Tigger's Construct and a lot of people Ooh, thank you free stuff thanks uh, in order to do that you need clay gravel stone and whatnot and the male birds decide that he's going to want to have sex with the female bird while I'm having <laughs> while I'm having this recording yes that is a cockatoo talking to its mate wanting to have sex <laughs> oh that's a little fucking embarrassing uh, hold on real quick I don't know if this will stop him.
you. <laughs> and he doesn't stop. He'll do that until he gets his way. I guess that's what us dudes do. <laughs> it's funny, but it's not funny because it's irritating as hell. Anyways, let me let me put down my spawn point. So this is gonna be our kind of like bedroom area for now. Uh, in purgatory. Oh man, this dude. <laughs> This dude, wow, okay. And so in purgatory, you cannot sleep when it's night. Oh my goodness, you cannot sleep when it's night. Let me finish, please! Um, <laughs> so what you do is you put down your bed and you basically right click on it and it says your spawn location has been set, enjoy the night. So basically now we are, we, are, we have no torches here. I just now noticed that, where are my torches? Okay, that's not good. We need torches. This place will become Monster Haven. <laughs> oh, I hate him so much sometimes, but he's so funny. Um, I also went ahead and took all our stuff and put it down here. Again, we cannot use iron until we have a pickaxe that is harvestable. So if you look here, my pickaxe is not harvestable to do iron. It can do copper and it can do aluminum. Shh, you're worse than the bird. Um, so I cannot do that, so, uh, yeah, um, what am I looking for here? I'm looking for my torches. I got torches. Why did that come down here? Damn it. Okay. So, uh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking about killing a bird, number one, and number two, <laughs> oh man, he's trying so hard. Uh, I'm thinking about making this like my heart making this like an underground base facility uh that way i have the ability to gather cobblestone that's pretty much this is pretty much where i've gotten the cobblestone and the cobblestone is my old mine shaft that's um across the way um but i'm thinking about doing it here and then um having a mine shaft attached to it but i'm kind of afraid if i do that there's a possibility that something may spawn oh he, he quit she must have been like no you're not getting any shut your face anyways Thank God. Uh, yep, yeah, he he didn't get any. He's pissed. <laughs> I, I don't know if you can hear him, but it, it's just funny. It's funny to me. I can't help it. We got zucchini and we got cucumbers. Let me eat two of these zucchinis. Three of these zucchinis. What the hell? No! I don't want that in there. And here comes the spiders. Uh, no! No! Stop eating that! You jerk! For some reason, they ju he just manually grabs shit out of his inventory. Look at that! Okay, stop. See, the problem is, is if he does that, and he wants to eat, and eat, I get greedy. See, watch. Okay, I know this is a good thing, but he'll he'll manually eat stuff in the inventory. So stop! Stop it, White! Anyways, we're well fed, so hopefully we'll get our hearts some. I'll get the hearts some back. Um, I like this mod pack. I really do. This is kind of better than um, Epic Craft because there's not so much to do. Ooh, hello. There's not so much to deal with. Get out of here. Get. Look at that. They're just dropping shit everywhere. You think I should go get that? I don't know if it was enchanted, but I think I can melt that. Can I get this? Thank you. Anything over here? Uh, but a lot of these tools and stuff you can melt and get iron off of, which is pretty sweet. Um. Oh, hello. 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 I bet you have a lot of health, don't you? Oof. You look evil. I'm not messing with that. Nope. 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 All right. So, anyways, um, what else? Uh, I'd give you. Let me give you the grand tour real quick. So, this is the first tower that we have. I call this my level of observation. So, as you can see. They can't see me, so they don't come after me. Is that an Enderman over there? Might be an Enderman. I know there's many ones. It's pretty cool. Uh, and then the next towers up is going to be where I can place stuff. Like if I have something like extra stuff I want to put up here, or perhaps there's a mod that I need, a mod that needs um, needs to be separated. I can do that. Again, another observation tower, which is a little bit higher. That looks so cool from right there. 
kind of looks like we have neighbors, but in reality, we don't. I'm going to put glass right here. Uh, so we'll have a, a glass ceiling. A gl glass? Glass ceiling. There we go. Uh, and then, of course, these uh, ladders are actually made by Tinker's Construct. Uh, you just uh, take cobblestone, put two pieces of cobblestone, like you're doing sticks, and you make uh, cobblestone sticks. And that's pretty cool. Another observation room from the back so we can always observe, of course, this side, as always. My goodness, look at the entities. 200. I can live with 200. Point in that direction. Uh, hopefully the chunks stop. I think what happens is I'm too far away, so the chunks stop loading, and eventually the the uh, mobs will um, despawn. Uh, also, again, I'm going to put glass up here. This is really just my big observatory area, so that's pretty nifty. Um, yeah, and then of course you saw the bedroom already, and uh, we're going to turn this area into a kitchen, hopefully. So, because we're going to need a lot of stuff for the kitchen. And of course we have our patio area, which is completely uh, cobblestone in. I was going to use wood, but I kind of ran out of wood. So, I kind of used the wooden, uh, the wooden fences in another area that I was planning on living. And it kind of failed miserably. So, yeah, that kind of sucked. But, uh, I'm using the trap doors. Uh, not as decorations per se, but as much as... Uh, a hindrance. I'm missing one right here, though. That's a problem. Um, and because the reason why is because the, the trap doors actually keep things from, like, spiders, per se, from falling on me. And it also kind of protects me from... Can you see me? I'm wondering if they can see me. Nope, maybe not. Okay. But it also keeps, like, skeletons from shooting down at me and things like that. So, that's pretty cool. So, uh... Here's the plans, so that that way I can kind of like end the episode here, or begin the episode, or stop the episode. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and gather up some gravel. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and gather up all this marble, which we can use uh, for our kitchen, perhaps. Um, I kind of screwed up when I made this house. I didn't double layer it, so a lot of stuff has to be done through the floor, as far as energy-wise is concerned. So a lot of my pipes, say like my energy pipes and my liquid pipes, will have to be outside the house. So I may change that up if I have to. So I don't know, but I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna do this as a 15 by 15 or a 20 by 20. I'm not 100% sure. If I remember straight, I gotta go one, two, three, four, two, three, four, five. I think I gotta go seven layers down or eight layers down to have a, a tree farm in here. Or I may look for the tree farm outside. I don't know. I, I want to be more outside. I'm playing Epic Craft. It's gotten me to the point where I just want to be outside all the time. But being outside. And this mob pack is pretty dangerous. So I may want to go find a desert somewhere. Which, I mean, we're far from a desert. I mean, we're just... I don't even know where a desert would be at in what direction. Ooh, there's lava right there. Um, but I need to find a desert and... I need to get sand, and I need to get all kinds of stuff. Ooh, it's a half a full moon. So he can't, so they, can they see me? Maybe they can. Maybe he's just climbing, because he can. See? He can't. Hey, I would have been hit. Hey. Bye-bye. Hello? Hey, how you doing? Whoa, I decapitated your head, sucker. I decapitated your... So they they die. If they lose their head, they die. Excuse me, sir. Let's test it. Oh, they bleed out. Ooh. Now that's cool. Oh, there's a plague zombie. What if I hit him in the head? One shot. Oh no. Come here. Come here. Oh, you're on fire. Oh, he died. He died. Dude. Hello, get down here. Hmm. So that's cool. I didn't know that. Ooh, piece of armor. Where'd you go? Ow. Jerk. And another zombie head. Ooh, we got some. Push some. Oh, I forgot that one stuff, didn't I? Oopsie. I'll have to work on that. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna be kind of like the game plan. I have not gone in there yet. However, if my observational eyes are pretty good, 
there's actually two of those things so from right here and then there's one right here if I can if I can zoom down where it doesn't screw it up yeah see there's one right there and then there's one right here so that's gonna be pretty interesting I hope that's not a dungeon I really hope it's not Ooh, look the zoom in feature even still works on the mini map Oof. let's back that up a little bit there we go yeah uh, also something to note as well uh, a lot of let's players are starting to see you see how full my inventory is and see my weight limit is 3.0 if you look up to the top left it says 3.0 over 220 48.0 that's actually your weight and then of course you see I'm at 14 percent weight capacity uh, in this mod pack you have a weight capacity issue that you have to worry about so for example um, let's just dump this stuff in here for now. I'll have to sort all this out later on. I'm so happy. I hope this is actually wheat. That'd be great. Okay, so look at my look at my weight now. 1.0, 3%. All right, you ready for something crazy? Watch this. Watch my watch. Watch my weight. My I'm literally 26%. But look how slow I'm going. Okay, so. This is kind of this is kind of something that you have to pay attention to in the beginning. So let's count: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right? Okay. So that's a straight line. It takes me ten seconds to get from there to there. Right? Okay. So let's put these up real quick. Come on, come on, come on. Weights down. Okay. Weights off. All right. From the same spot. Right? Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. See? Now, I bet you if we dropped, I don't know, I, I have not tested this, so I'm not 100% sure, but if we dropped all our weight off of us, okay? This includes our armor. We'll take our armor off, too. By the way, I've had to make like three of these damn things. Waste amount of wood. Alright, so we're at zero weight right now, so let's see if this actually applies to our uh, our weight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. So, in a matter of just a few seconds, or whatever you want to call it, uh, weight can be an issue. So that's pretty cool. That's something to note, as always. Uh, so let's check out our quest book here, see if there's anything... That I haven't done yet. Uh, I don't know if I showed you, because it's been a while. So we're still working on this one. I got the grapes and I got the blackberries, but I don't have strawberries and I don't have raspberry, which blows. I haven't made these yet because I want to do that on camera. Uh, a plastic bag. I think if we can do this, I think I can get this reward and then turn it in for here to get this reward. And that's the knapsack, which is going to be pretty difficult. And I can't do this one right now because I don't have any iron. And I need to make charcoal. So I think we'll do that one before we end the episode. This is rubber. I don't want to use rubber. Oh, wait. There we go. I just need a piece of charcoal. So it's a big deal there. And then we'll end the episode here. I don't know how long this episode is. And I don't think we got very much done today. Except for the moving purposes. Um... But uh, over and all, I think I've I, I've been watching other Let's players play this thing, and it's really cool to see how people how people do it differently. Like some people just go straight into a dungeon and, and die constantly, and then a lot of people like uh, where's this quest at? Let me show you this quest right here. See this little thing right here? Everybody keeps it keeps getting it backwards. They keep thinking it's another tool station. In reality, you have to make you have to make the big pattern chest before you can make yeah you know, just follow this lineup make your state stencils make your pattern make you part or part and then make your tool station and the quest will work for you it's maybe a little buggy or whatnot I don't know spice life I need a, a piece of wheat and I need a, a leather I need a book and I'm hoping that castle over there will have a book I have not been able to find an enderman yet uh, because I basically get my ass whooped instantaneously so most of these, if you, you have to follow these quests, as I learned with like, uh, where was it, uh, this one? No. No. Uh-oh. I'm hungry. This one? No. Where the hell is it at? Where's the one that you have to make 
the... I guess this is it. Huh. Okay. That's weird. I thought you had to make like... Oh, I'm thinking Purgatory. I'm not th Purgatory. I'm thinking about the other uh, Feed the Beast one I'm, I'm looking at doing. Uh, but if you don't, even if you create these and you make the knife, it won't count. So make sure you're following the... You're following what the quest book requests. And always go back and look. Because you can't really jump ahead as much as it would be nice if you could. Okay, I've got these already. I need some of these. Some of these. Okay. Eat all of this up. Shut up. I know there's a cave somewhere around here. Oop. There we go. Alright. Alright, so what were we doing? Uh, charcoal. Alright, let's turn that quest in. And then uh, we'll, we'll call it wraps for today. I know, like I said, not a lot's done. This is kind of like a tourism tour thing. Um, we only need one piece of charcoal. And I believe it was this one. And we already made torches. By the way, you can make torches with uh, rubber... Rubber... Uh, rubber... If you can't find charcoal. And I don't know if this will be taken away later on. Oh, there it is. You can take uh, raw rubber with stick and uh, make... Um, make torches so I'll, but what I did here is I had actual charcoal and I just took the cobblestone sticks and uh, I used the cobblestone uh, tinkers um, uh, torches because I think they look better so anyways we've got that done we've got that done so let's claim our reward yay we're getting there this is going to be a little work right here this one won't be too much so yay how exciting I'm really excited for this one Hand in one ender pearl. You get an ender pearl back. Stupid, but I can live with it. I think this is the warp book. If this is an actual quest reward, that's gonna be awesome. So I don't know. We'll find out. I'm gonna keep this. Eh, we'll just use charcoal. Let's finish that one off. So, anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. Likes and comments are greatly appreciated. Moving day sucks. And building this thing sucked too, but luckily we got it done. And like I said, we'll pretty it up. Maybe later on down the road or something, we'll make it look good. I've screwed up there, right there. Should have fixed. Should have kept the line going. See that line, the wood line. I was hoping to keep that. Oh, I failed. Oh. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. I really want to go in there. Bye.